enjoying yourself, my love. Fascinating, isn't it? Everyone has changed so much. Yet the heart of it all feels so familiar. I can't wait to say hello, but to be honest, I'm keen to visit the doctor before it gets too late. He said there's a potential in his infirmary. A very old woman recently diagnosed with a wasting sickness. She seemed uh, interested in what I have to offer. I want to have a good long talk with her before we make an arrangement. Though, if I'm being very selfish, I hope she'll say yes. I'm absolutely famished. And think of all those memories. I don't hide it well, do I? Some things don't change, even when everything else does. It's funny. I'm hungry in my body, but in my soul, too. That woman has lived a long life. Births, deaths, love, misfortune. And if she agrees, I'll be able to give her a dignified end and remember it all in her honor. But hey, I'm getting ahead of myself. Let's enjoy ourselves. This is a rare enough treat, isn't it? I'm sure of very little these days. But at least this way I can live. And those who offer themselves to me can live on too. Birds, first loves, marriages, losses. I remember them all and always will. Each memory I've consumed is of value. But let's focus on the task at hand. We've been brought here to enjoy ourselves and see some old faces. Let's not be rude. Always, darling.